Ah, good day everyone and welcome to a brand new series called episode, I guess. Um, so I've seen this plate. Oh shoot, what's going on? I feel like it's already started. I've seen a couple YouTubers play this game, but I've never watched their gameplay, but it seems like they have a lot of fun doing it because they keep posting it. So today I'm going to test it out. Um, we're going to see how uh, uh, I enjoy it and if we want to continue, but basically it's like a choose your own adventure storyline. It's on my phone, so I'm going to be looking down at my phone while we play this. Uh, so let's begin. Ready to heat up your love life? Flirt, scheme, and party your way to true love in the sizzling romance. Walk it down the street. Uh, 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 hold up! <gasps> what is going on? <gasps> why, why is she getting her picture taken? Am I the girl or am I a boy? Because how do I... I mean, I'm just going to say my name is Joey because they're asking me what my name is. Do I want to change... Oh, I'm her. Yes, I want to switch up my look. Okay, well, she's a girl Joey, I guess. Oh, this is fun. It's like Sims. Okay, so let's do hair. Um, let, I like long hair. Which long style... Oh, it's not like Sims. I just get the option that I don't get to see what it looks like. Let's do um loose curls. No, bombshell waves. Ooh, that's pretty. I like the bombshell waves, yes. Change hair color. Let's do dyed colors. <gasps> ooh, ooh. Ooh, the pink's pretty. Lilac. I like the hot pink, honestly. It's a really pretty. Um, okay. Tied up style. What is that? High ponytail? Mmm, nah. Try other styles. Okay, no, I wanna do this. That is cute. This looks great. Okay. Now let's work on our nose. A button. I can't, I honestly can't see a difference in any of these. Oh, I kind of see. Okay. Oh, that one's so cute. Okay, that looks great. Let's do skin tone, rose tones. Oh, wow. Oh my God, that kind of looks like Lizzie. Holy crap. I like this one. That looks great. Um, eyes, round eyes, almond eyes, sharp eyes, slender eyes. I like, I like almond. We love almonds. We love to be healthy. Let's change eye color. Turquoise. Oh, that's scary. I'm literally, literally making Lizzie. This is weird. Okay, hold on. Let me change the hair color because this is getting, <laughs> starting to look a lot like her. Does that still look like her? Oh gosh. Maybe, um, let's see. Honestly, I'm kind of living for that, but no, I have to do, I have to do a colored hair. We'll go with the lilac. She'll be Lark. I think that's pretty. <gasps> she looks perfect! Oh my gosh. I'm so mad that I named her Joey. Your name's Lark. Psst. <gasps> You're about to meet a cute guy. Oh my god, can't wait. Okay, what should you be wearing? Edgy leather and lace, blue jeans, baby queen. Um, blue jeans, baby queen. Oh, that is so adorable. Is this the like la la? Huh? Yes, wear it. Cute. Looking good, Joey. This is so weird. Okay, I didn't know. <laughs> Are you ready to take a city by storm? Oh, heck yes. Oh, wait, can I, I want to change something? My looks, my outfit. No, no, no. You're good. You're good. You're good. You're good. Just kidding. Just kidding. Okay, let's take the city by storm. Part one. Welcome to New York. <laughs> this is like Gossip Girl. Okay. Oh, I'm finally here. Oh, she's about to get hit by a car. Whoa, hang on. I, why is she fainting? I'm so confused. Oh my God, how dramatic. Oh my God, I think you saved my life. Um, you can let me go now. Oh, I don't know what he looks like. Um, I think he was cute. So we'll say, oh my God, you saved my life. Kind of looks like me from behind. Okay, I thought for sure I was going to fall. Mmm. No, not feeling it, Ethan. Not feeling. I mean, he's kind of actually cute. He's kind of everything. Okay. Catching you was the least I could do after running you over. He ran her over? <laughs> what? <gasps> okay. I'm Ethan, by the way. Hi, I'm Joey. <sighs> Listen, I feel terrible about knocking you over. How can I make it up to you? She's like, well, now that you mention it, um, I'm willing to call it a truce. What do you have in mind? I'm going to say he totally owes me. You know, the welcome wagon is supposed to roll up. Not over you. I don't understand what just happened. Okay. Well, lucky for you. 
This welcome wagon happens to be born and raised New Yorker. I'd love to show you around. <gasps> oh, bitch. Is that his girlfriend? Who's Sydney? Who the hell is she? Um, excuse me. <gasps> Sydney, what's going on here? <laughs> oh, hi. I'm Joey. Uh, excuse me. Uh, I wasn't talking to you. Oh, uh, Sydney, this is Joey. She just moved. <laughs> no time to chat. But I'll see you tonight, Ethan. Yup. I'll be there. Perfection! Toodles! Uh-oh, that's awkward. Um, sorry, Joey. Uh, that was uh, a very warm welcome. Uh, it's cool. You're at least nice. I can't freaking speak. <laughs> but listen, I would really love to show you around the city. <gasps> Seriously? <sighs> Aren't you sick of all the tour spots? <laughs> Actually, no. I've never been to any. When you're a native, you miss out on all that stuff. <laughs> She's like, uh -huh. you're lying. Like, oh, like wearing these t-shirts. Bitch, where the hell did these magical t-shirts appear from? Did he just undress me? Excuse me. <laughs> Who the hell is she? Oh my god, you guys are the cutest couple I've ever seen. Love the matching tees. Oh, love his boat shoes. Maybe this is me. See, we look awesome. Come on. I don't know why I'm making this his voice. We'll go to the Statue of Liberty. <laughs> <gasps> Times Square. <laughs> Coney. I've never been to Coney Island. She does not look happy there. Um, what do you say? Will you play tours with me for the day? OMG. A private tour of the iconic spots with an extremely hot New Yorker. <clears throat> 15 diamonds? I don't have 15 diamonds. Oh, do I get 15 diamonds? Okay. I have to buy these diamonds to go... Oh, bitch, this is how they make their money. All right, well, we're exploring New York City with Ethan for 15 freaking diamonds. I'm so in. Yes, this is gonna be amazing. Uh, I wonder if Ethan's actually secretly gay. That would be everything. Okay, first things first. Ah, get in the taxi. Why is she literally jiggling her legs? This is... Let me jiggle my legs, that's how sad I am. The best way to get around New York City is a classic New York taxi. Oh my god, just like in the movies. What is that walk? Stop. Gary, come on, Edward Cullen. Taxi driver, where to? Okay, Joey, it's your first day in New York City. You choose where we go. Honestly, I want to go to Coney Island since I've never been there in person. I've always dreamed about going there. Well... I'm all for making your dreams come true. This is kind of creepy. Like, literally, this guy just... Where's his car? I thought he ran her over. Look, that's where I lost my first two... What? <laughs> that park bench? <laughs> yup, my grandma and I were waiting for the bus. Wow, I can't imagine growing up here. It was pretty great for the most part. I don't know if I could ever leave. Hmm. Um, you're not worried you're missing on something else. I'm not here forever. Um, yeah, let's do... You're not worried about missing something else if he's never left. I think everyone should leave home at some point or another. <laughs> Just saying. Yeah, I guess. Oh, the beach. I wish I had more options with my boys. Oh my god, look at this place. It's even brighter in person. What the hell does that mean, brighter in person? Like the sun is shining brighter? Last one to the roller coaster is the subway rat. <gasps> Dare you call me a rat? I hate the way they run. Oh my god, that roller coaster was about to freaking fly off the freaking rails. Oh, prick your prize. Okay. Joey, what'll it be? Hmm. Uh. A giraffe, a kitty, a, pe a peacock. No, we're going with the kitty. <gasps> oh, so cute. Oh my god, I love how I literally said the exact same thing as her IRL. Kind of like you. Oh, bitch, he wants me. Little does he know I'm actually a man. Here, let's get a picture with our spoils. 
Oh, I love this one. <laughs> what happened to his finger? Oh, where do we go next? Um, let's go to Times Square. It's the most iconic place in New York City. And iconic is definitely what we're going for. How is this still the same taxi driver? Got it. Times Square. Here we come. I don't know what voice to do for the taxi man. Oh my god. Is that Zac Efron? Yep. He used to be my neighbor. <gasps> Seriously? Uh -huh. Yep. Wow. New York City is so magical. Yeah. But the best parts of the city are the secret ones in my opinion. Like that dinner over- a diner. Sorry. I didn't mean to say dinner. I meant to say diner over there. My friends and I used to go there after swim practice every Wednesday. That place? But it looks so... <laughs> Ordinary? Maybe. But the pancakes are life-changing. Oh my god, do you like still swim? Take many breakfast dates? Oh yeah, let's see if he takes many breakfast dates there. Hmm. You know, when late nights come, become early mornings. That place isn't just for any date. I would only share that place with someone super special. If word got out, it would become a zoo. <gasps> but you just told me about it. <gasps> then I guess you must be special. I seriously feel like this guy's creepy and he's like literally gonna take me to kill me. You there! <laughs> me? And him. I sense a powerful connection between you two. Well, if it's the Times Square fortune teller says it, then you know it must be true. <laughs> hey, it just occurred to me. We can't leave Times Square without getting something from one of the street vendors. Come on, whatever she wants and make it double. Well, what will it be? <laughs> um, a hot dog or a pretzel? Honestly, a pretzel. Thanks so much. No problem. I love to see young people in love. Oh my god, this is so annoying. We're not in love, we just met. How long have you been together? Um, let's play along. Almost a full year. Right, sweetie? <laughs> really? Has it been that long? Time goes by so quickly. Every day with her feels like the first, you know? That's beautiful. Take care, you tell. Wanna take a picture with our classic New York City street food? Definitely! <sighs> he loves the selfie. He is a pervert. Look at his freaking fingers. Oh my god. Oh my god, our food somehow looks even better than in real life. <laughs> hey, you just about ready to get out of here? Sure, let's head out. We were only here for like two seconds, but sure. <laughs> Come on. This is where he takes you back to his place and kills you. Oh, what do you want to do next? Honestly, I don't really care about the set of the date, so I'm done exploring. Oh, I'm totally wiped out from all this exploring. Uh, cool if we stop the tour here. For sure, I'm pretty tired myself. Okay, now that we've seen two of New York City's most famous spots, it's time I show you the more authentic side of the city. You'll see. I hate the way they walk. It's so creepy. Welcome to the spot. <laughs> it's literally called the spot. Oh, best bar in the city. Oh, oh, this place is great. Uh, we think so. Oh, I'm nervous of her. <gasps> Zoe! Uh, hey, Rumi. How's your friend? I mean, who's your friend? Haha. <laughs> Oh, this is Joey. She just moved here. <gasps> Ethan just took me on a city tour of the whole city. <laughs> Whoa, cool. What did you see? All the iconic spots. Times Square, Coney Island, and the Statue of Liberty. We did not see the Statue of Liberty. You are a liar, Joey. And finally, the spot. I saved the best for last. Sounds like the perfect New York City tour to me. Are you two roommates? Where are you from, Zoe? I'm dying for a drink. <gasps> Ooh, yes, let's get drunk. Oh, where's the bartender? Oh, Brandon? <laughs> He's around here somewhere. You'll love him, Joey. He's basically an honorary roommate. <gasps> they used to date. Oh my god, they were together. 
if it is my favorite customers. <gasps> Speak of the devil. Here's Brandon now. What can I get y'all? <laughs> Joey, you're dying for a drink. What do you want? Ooh, beer, white wine, lemonade. Mmm, nah, I don't like any of those. We'll go with lemonade. Ugh, it's so hot out. I need something refreshing. <gasps> that sounds perfect. Make it two, B. And I'll take a margarita. Thanks. <gasps> two lemonades and a margarita coming right up. So, Joey was it? Yep, that's me. So, Joey, where'd the roommate find you? Actually, Ethan sort of ran me over with his bike. Oh, he was on a bike. That's why he didn't have a car. Okay, understood. Leave it to Ethan to see a cute girl and swerve. Oh, bitch, are you kidding me? And then actually get you to come out to the spot with him. What do you do? Offer free drinks in exchange for forgiveness? <laughs> no, not quite. He took me on a tour of the entire city. Whoa, impressive. Ethan really stepped up his game to for you. What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> Honey, let me fill you in on a little secret. Lifelong New Yorkers like Ethan avoid tourist destinations like the plague. Ethan wouldn't hike all the way to the Statue of Liberty Island unless he was totally into you. Girl, we didn't go there. Really? You think Ethan's into me? Hey, don't quote me. Just saying. He must think there's something special about you to go through all that trouble. <sighs> oh my god, I'm blushing. Oh, ew, that wink was so creepy. I'm Brandon, by the way. I'm nice to meet you, Brandon. Ethan told me your bar was the best. Um, ooh, did you always want to own a bar? Is this a good place to meet people? Any advice on getting closer to Ethan? Ah, yes, closer to Ethan. Um, between you and me, um, I'm kind of feeling a major spark between us. You're friends with Ethan. How would I get closer to him? Hmm, good question. Let's see. Well, Ethan's always volunteering to taste test my new drink recipes. He says he's been doing it to be nice, but I just think he really fancies cocktails. Actually, we're having a special cocktail tasting event tonight. Oh my god, really? Yeah, but it's a VIP event and we're completely sold out. <laughs> Bummer. But hey, you're new in town. You deserve a break. Tell you what. If you want to come, just give me a call, and I'll let you on the list. Well, bitch, I want to freaking go, obviously. Oh my god, thanks, Brandon. I'll let you know. Okay, go tell him you want to go. So, Ethan just told me how you met. <laughs> Almost run down by a bicyclist on your first day. <laughs> Sounds pretty dramatic. Yeah, definitely knows how to make an entrance. I believe it. Bond with Ethan or bond with Zoe? Honestly, let's bond with Zoe. I'm over Ethan right now. Ring, ring. Sorry, that's my mom. So, oh, so I met Sydney. In fact, I think she's like the reason Ethan offered to take me on the big New York City tour. She was so rude to me, I think he felt bad. Ugh, I'm not surprised. It's so sick of that jealous girlfriend, Barbie. Huh? girlfriend so then she is ethan's girlfriend with those two it's impossible to say they've been on and off since i met ethan literally it seemed like they're on the rocks oh you see i can't believe he has a freaking girlfriend another round hell no we're leaving sorry i wish i could but um my new raiment is expecting me another time i'm gonna hold you to that joey Definitely. Let's see you later, Joey. Ethan, you're sick. <gasps> this is it? Knock on the door. Yes, let's go in. <gasps> no! You. <gasps> oh, hell no. You're the Joey who's renting my extra room? You're my new roommate? I think so. I prefer not to live with boyfriends standing, stealing randos. Wait, what? Bye. Oh my gosh. What am I going to do? I have no place to live. Oh, oh God, I don't even have anywhere to sleep tonight. Better call someone for help. 
Call Ethan. Oh. Let's call. Let's call Zoe. I feel like. No. I want to call freaking Ethan. Hi. Uh, Joey, this is a nice surprise. I didn't expect to hear from you so soon. What's up? Do we miss a spot on our New York City tour top? Tower top? I wish that's why we're calling. Ethan, I just met my roommate. It's Sydney. And she kicked me out. Ethan, I have nowhere to go. What am I going to do? She kicked you out? Dang, Joey. I'm so sorry. I can't believe that she did that. We'll figure this out. Don't worry. Meet me at the spot in 15 minutes. <laughs> That's right. Ethan? What exactly are we doing here? I can't just drink my sudden homelessness away. I need a plan. And I've got one. Look up. <gasps> See those windows on the, tor top, on the top floor? Yeah, what about them? That's where I live. Right above the spot? That's so cool. I'm glad you think so, because you're staying the night. Oh. Uh-oh, I'm nervous. This is it, home sweet home. Oh, our humble abode, and for tonight, yours. We're actually looking for a new roommate, so this worked out perfectly. So wait, seriously, you're the best. Oh, who the hell is she? Not so fast. Ethan and Zoe may vouch for you, but this space, I'm s it's sacred. The three of us live together perfectly. We're soulmate friends. And we take the whole roommate thing very seriously. Basically, she's saying you cannot stay the night. But if you want to make this permanent, You've got to prove you can hang. Got it? Okay, totally. I can definitely hang. Great. In that case, welcome. I'm Isabel, by the way. So nice to meet you. Enough chit chat. Let's show you where you're staying tonight. Oh my gosh, that view. All right, this is like a luxury freaking place. Holy wow. Like it? It's incredible. But how come it's not already taken? Oh, it's about Noah's room. He's on tour with Ben right now. But it's all yours tonight. Let's say, um, let's say we want to stay here forever. This place is amazing. And you guys are so, I don't even know what it said. <laughs> I wish I could stay more than one night. Well, if tonight goes well, then maybe you will. <laughs> this sleepover is going to be so much fun. This is great, Joey. As soon as you left the spot earlier, I was wishing you were hanging with us tonight. Ring, ring. It's Sydney. I better take this. Ugh, not her again. <gasps> Sid, hey. Okay, is it just me or does Sydney have crazy eyes? <laughs> At least we won't be able to have to deal with her for long. I mean, come on, it's Ethan. What's that supposed to mean? Buzz buzz. <gasps> is, <gasps> what is it? Uh-oh. What? Who's that? M -m my boyfriend. <gasps> oh, hell no. Ex-boyfriend is ex. You broke up with him. So why do you torture yourself by getting notifications every time he posts a new picture? Now get it together before you scare off Joey. Okay, we have already forgotten that Tevin categorically sucked. I, I just wish there was some way I could take my mind off him. You know, back home, I went through a really bad breakup. You did? Yep, and the only thing that helped get over my ex was a night in with my girls. Pampering yourself and being surrounded by your friends is the best antidote to a broken heart. Oh my god, a girl's night sounds perfect. We could set up a spa station, do sheet masks, and give ourselves pedicures. Play truth or dare, make prank calls. Totally. Oh my god, we have to do this. Do what? Joey just had the best idea. A super girly night of bonding and spa activities. It's the only way I'll ever get over this wretched breakup with Tevin. No way, that sounds awesome, Joey. It also kind of perfect because Sid just called to say she'd be three hours late 
and I've got time to kill. Though, you guys are allowed to come to girls' night? Absolutely. Guys need pedicures too, you know. Joey, if you help us plan this epic girls' night, you'd more than prove you belong in this apartment with us. I agree, 100%. This is exactly the kind of thing we look for in a roommate. If I do this for the girls and Ethan, I'll definitely get to live here. Okay, guys, tonight's going to be awesome. All right, guys, I'm going to stop the episode here. If you guys enjoyed this and you want to see me play more, hit the like button and I will record more of this series. It's definitely very different from anything I've done, but this is kind of fun. I'm like so invested. So uh, yeah, leave me a like, leave me a comment and I love you guys. And until next time, I'll see you next time. Good damn bye.